a Byzantine talismanic grave tablet used to protect from evil found in a castle. Archaeologists have unearthed a mysterious burial tablet believed to date back to the Byzantine period during excavations at Silivki Castle in southern Turkey. The talismanic artifact, found within the 185-meter-high hilltop fortress, offers intriguing insights into the region's history. Silivka Castle, a Byzantine stronghold originally built to defend against 7th-century Arab raids, has been the focus of ongoing restoration efforts. The 13th phase of these excavations, led by Professor Ali Boran, has led to the discovery of this unique burial tablet. The castle's moat, two dozen towers, and vaulted underground chambers once served as a strategic command center for the Byzantine Empire. Archaeologists are continuing to study the recently discovered burial tablet from Silivki Castle. Preliminary analysis suggests that the artifact served as a talismanic protection against evil and enemies, intended for use in buildings or tombs. According to Professor Ali Baran, the leader of the excavation team, this season's discoveries have shed new light on the ancient architectural structures within the castle complex. Based on the inscriptions, this is a magical tablet designed to ward off evil and protect the building or tomb it was placed in bore and explained to AA. Our epigraphy experts are conducting a thorough analysis, but it's clear that this site is not merely a city but has a multifaceted significance. Despite extensive excavations, archaeologists have yet to discover a grave structure within Silivki Castle. However, the recently unearthed talismanic tablet suggests that a burial site once existed in this location. This artifact holds significant historical importance for both the region and Anatolia, offering valuable insights into the past. The tablet was discovered west of the mosque. While it's not particularly large, its content and writing style make it a valuable find. Boran likened the tablet's protective function to the modern-day Nazarbankugu, noting that such talismans have been used throughout history to ward off harm. The presence of this artifact at Silif Castle highlights the site's deeper cultural and historical significance beyond its architectural and urban features. Rare Celtic helmet unearthed in Poland. Archaeologists in Poland have made a groundbreaking discovery. A rare Bronze Age Celtic helmet, dating back to the 4th century BC, has been unearthed in Mazovia. This extraordinary find is one of only a handful of its kind known worldwide, showcasing the advanced metallurgical skills of ancient Celtic artisans. The helmet was discovered alongside a trove of Celtic treasures, including axes, spearheads, a sword, and decorative horse harness during excavations at the Lysa Gora archaeological site. Led by Dr. Bartlomie Kaczynski, the research team from the State Archaeological Museum and the University of Warsaw has uncovered over 300 artifacts in this area since spring. Wojciech Borkowski, deputy director of the State Archaeological Museum, emphasized the significance of the find. This is the first helmet of its kind discovered in Poland and the oldest ancient helmet ever uncovered in the country. The previous record was held by a helmet from Siemiakau, dating to the first century BC. Archaeologists have uncovered a significant defensive settlement at the Lysagora site, where the rare Celtic helmet was found. Spanning approximately three hectares, the settlement likely served as a stronghold during a period of conflict between the Celts and the Vandals, as evidenced by burn marks. Lisa Gora is a multi-period site with the earliest traces of human activity dating back to the Lusatian culture, which inhabited this region during the Late Bronze and Early Iron Ages. Initially, the newly discovered helmet was mistaken for a bronze vessel due to its distinctive shape. However, further analysis revealed its true identity as an early Latin helmet, a rare artifact representative of a European Iron Age society that flourished centuries ago. Wojciech Borkowski emphasized the global significance of this discovery, 
noting that only a handful of such helmets exist worldwide. This find challenges previous assumptions that Celtic settlements were confined to southern Poland, providing concrete evidence of their presence in the northern region of Mazovia. The discovery of a rare Celtic helmet and other artifacts at Lysa Gora has forced archaeologists to reevaluate the amber trade routes of the early Iron Age and the broader European trade networks. The diverse range of objects unearthed, including bronze ornaments and iron tools, suggests a more complex and interconnected trading system than previously thought. This discovery holds significant implications not only for Poland but also for the wider Central European region. Due to its damaged condition, the helmet has been sent to the Museum Conservation Department of the PMA for restoration. This process is expected to take several months, after which the artifact can be fully appreciated and studied by researchers, 